Hey guys, Nurse Blake here, and welcome, Mike, get out of, <laughs> get out of my shot. And welcome to simplenursing.com. Before we start today's video, please remember to access your free quiz and preview our new study guides not on YouTube. Click the link right up here anytime during this video. All right, let's get to it. Maria is a 74-year-old female presenting with complaints of diarrhea three times a day, muscle spasms, and tingling of the lips and fingers. She has a history of thyroidectomy and osteoporosis. Upon reviewing her labs, the nurse finds serum calcium level of 7.2, potassium of 2.9, and a sodium level of 125. Oh snap, what could this be? And what are we going to prioritize as a nurse? What's up guys, I'm Nurse Blake, and today we're wrapping up both hyper and hypoparathyroidism. They are those little round button looking glands that sit on the back of the thyroid near the neck. These little dudes can cause so many problems with calcium, but we'll cover that in our patho section. So let's break down the terms. Hyper means high and hypo means low. Para means alongside and then thyroid means, well, thyroid. So hyper anything always means overactive like a hyper person. And hypo is the exact opposite, underactive, like a super boring person. The parathyroid glands are almost exclusively responsible for the regulation of blood calcium. So think PC, like a computer. P is for parathyroid and C is for calcium. And the levels are typically 9.0 to 10.5. However, some books will say 8.5 to 10.0. So be sure to know what your textbook says. The main point is the calcium, guys. If the parathyroid hormone is high, that means calcium is high. And when the parathyroid is low, what is the calcium? Yes, low. So hyperparathyroid means hypercalcemia and hypoparathyroid means hypocalcemia. Thanks for watching. For our full video and new quiz bank, Click up right here to access your free trial. And please consider subscribing to our YouTube channel. Last but not least, a big thanks to our team of experts for helping us make these great videos. See you guys next time.